Muslims believe that there is no deity worthy of worship except Allah. And this shouldn't be offensive for anybody, simply because the word Allah is an Arabic word that means the one true God. The word God is not an accurate translation for the word Allah because you can have derivatives from the word God. There's a goddess, false gods, Roman gods, Greek gods, true God, Godfather. But the word Allah means the one true God. Arab Christians and Jews worship Allah as well. In the very first page of the Arabic Christian Bible, the human eye reads the word Allah six times in the first paragraph of Genesis alone, 17 times in the whole page, and hundreds of times all through the Bible. There is no God except Allah. Muslims believe in the absolute uniqueness and awesome nature of our Creator. That means that He is not like His creation in His attributes, in His actions, or His essence. For if the Creator was like creation, He would not be worthy of worship. But in Islam, we believe that God, Allah, is absolutely unique and far removed from any likeness of His creation. For that reason, we do not draw pictures of Him or try to depict Him. We also believe that Allah, God Almighty, is the Creator of all. He's so merciful. He provides for everything that exists, from the birds in the heavens to the fish in the streams, to young children who play in the streets. He's so merciful that he even provides for those who deny his very existence, like Karl Marx, for example. Could you imagine at the end of the month if Karl Marx received a bill for his oxygen that said, look, Karl, if you don't pay this bill, we're cutting you off. But no, Allah, God Almighty, is so merciful that even those who deny him are recipients of his magnificent and awesome mercy. Muslims believe that Allah is unique. There is nothing like unto Him. He is the creator of man and the creator of animals, so He does not look like any man, nor any animal, nor any plant. He is truly beyond imagination. <laughs> ¶¶